So in Christ Jesus, you are all children of God through faith. For all of you who were baptized into Christ have clothed yourselves with Christ. There is neither Jew nor Gentile, neither slave nor free, nor is there male and female, for you are all one in Christ Jesus. The New Testament does not forbid much by way of worship. It is strongly worded that one does worship. Apparently, around modern Turkey, a Celtic peoples had settled there and Paul had stayed with them. Paul's letter is because Galatians had fallen from the habits. Paul preached towards a more legalistic view of Hebraic faith. Some Galatians were of the view of division, so that preaching took place with slaves separated from others, women separated from men, and so on. But before the Lord, none has more favor than another, all whom have been baptized before God. Slavery existed in biblical times, but the slave who was baptized, though still expected to serve their worldly master, would receive full entitlement before God. Something worth considering when discussing the working poor. My name is David Daniel Ball, and I am the Conservative Voice. David Daniel Ball is author of History of the World in a Year by the Conservative Voice.